Hello, I'm Rev. Michael Mugford, and I'm in ministry at Coal Harbor Woodside United Church, and I'm pleased to offer this spiritual reflection for United Churches for Dartmouth today. My theme today is pilgrimage. If you'd asked me uh, before this last Sunday, September 24th, if I had ever been on a pilgrimage, my answer would have been no. But after an overnight retreat at Berwick Camp with some amazing church colleagues, my answer would be yes. Yes, I have been on many pilgrimages. My idea of pilgrimage used to be the Camino de Santiago in Spain, or even one of the pilgrimages with Camino Nova Scotia in various parts of this province. Because of the retreat, though, I now see so many of the places that I have been in my life, some more distant than others, those have been pilgrimages too, whether I knew it or not. A pilgrimage, I've come to understand, is a journey that helps one to make a connection to the divine, to the holy, or to one's own meaning and being. It is about space and place, as Matthew Anderson of Camino Nova Scotia put it. Anderson told us that <clears throat> space is often an abstract concept, like coordinates on a map, or the name of a street or a building on that street. It's something that can mean much to the vast majority of, the pe of people. 15 Visit Road, Dartmouth, Nova Scotia, Canada, is the space which Coal Harbor Woodside United Church occupies. But there's really no intrinsic meaning to that space. Place, however, speaks to the meaning that we attach to a space. Coal Harbor Woodside United Church is the place where my children were dedicated. It's the community that formed me as a minister. It is the place where I minister. These are the meetings that it holds for me, or that I have invested in the space at 14, 15 Bissett Road. To others, the place is where the church family meets, or it's the place where they were married or buried a loved one. It may mean none of that to another person, or it may mean something completely different. Matthew Anderson talked about pilgrimage as being in or traveling to a place with intention. It may be a space before you go there, but if it has held meaning for you, then it is a place from which you have returned. Although I didn't think about it before, I went back to my childhood home in Deep River, Ontario, and in that I was making a pilgrimage to a place where I have happy and sad memories, experiences, and people who help to form me, who form who I am today. The annual uh, attending of the United Church Camp Meeting Association encampment at Berwick Camp has become an annual pilgrimage for me and for my family because of the meaning that it holds to us. These are not mere spaces to us anymore. They hold a meaningful purpose for us, either past or present. What spaces have become places for you in your life's journey? I invite you to think about this, and if you feel like it, you could leave a comment on Facebook or YouTube or wherever you happen to see this video. Until we can be together again, peace.